Number three, breath from alcohol. Nobody. Nobody. Brett gets his foot into a bathrobe session like a like an encyclopedia salesman south of the Mason-Dixon line in the 50s. He gets his foot in that door. Hey, Dennis. Have you ever thought of getting Sal on Extreme Makeover? I don't ever think of Sal. <laughs> so, no, I don't dial in a makeover for Sal. He's a... Uh, He's, he's Tyrone Power-esque in his male beauty. No, I don't. Uh, or maybe some sort of rehab with Dr. Drew. Why? Oh, here we go. His bathrobe session was an obvious cry for help. I have not seen the bathrobe session, much like Joe Dirt. I let it dwell in my mind, my imagination. I, I can't imagine what a trainer... I, I think what I'm seeing in my mind is Sal coming in and not budging off the Sal character. And I want to grab him and say, you know, the Sal character is not exactly Macbeth. You can alter it a little. You can take a breath periodically and just talk to the people. But no, he's rather intractable on issues like that. So a uh, cry for help? I'm not sure if it was a cry for help or a screw you. But let's see. Uh, he's bad. That cat's in a lot of pain. Hmm. I don't know him well enough to say that. I don't think so. He seems like a happy man. I think at least you should take away his car keys and his shoelaces. I'm just saying, I would hate to see him on the 6 o'clock news going bonkers at the Krispy Kreme or whatever. Ah, that's how it comes back yeah. to the Krispy Kreme. Trust me, the only bonkers you're going to see Sal judging from his uh, waistline the last time I saw him. I'm getting a little Adam West myself here in the distension category, but the last time I saw Sal is uh, you're going to see him lay like six of those donuts on his arm, like a waiter at the palm, and just inhale them. That, that'll, be the, uh, that'll be his equivalent of going bonkers there. Um, no, I don't, know, I don't know Sal all that well. Although we've been friends for years, but he seems like one of those friends who doesn't need you to peel back the artichoke, you know? You know? He wants to be left alone, and I do so because I'm his friend. So I can't say that he's in a lot of pain, but I don't think so. I think he's very happy with his wife and kid. Uh, he might hate me, granted. Probably not, though. I mean, Enjoy these samples of the bathrobe sessions, a weekly video available only to members of the DMZ, the Dennis Miller Zone on DennisMillerRadio.com.